Lord, I swear, look at the body on this bitch. This is a motherfucking painting. Look at the skin on this whore. I tell you something, if I had a body like that, I'd be pumping it out till Sunday morning, goddammit. I'd spread my pussy and give it to anybody who wanted it, and I wouldn't even charge. Now look at this. Is this woman, is she coming from a bath? Or perhaps is she on her way to the blood bank to give plasma? They give $10 a pint. Either case, look at the frame. This ain't no bullshit discount furniture shit. This is real gold gilded fucking frame. I swear, if I had a body like this bitch, I swear to God, I'd get me a pimp. And I'd sell my pussy until the cows came home. I'm talking moo, moo, moo. I'd get me a black pimp and get some chocolate milk for that dude. कुछ नहीं होगा जय तुम ठीक हो जाओगे तुम ठीक हो जाओगे लेकिन लेकिन फिर तूने हमारी दोस्ती की कहानी जरूर सुनाना ये कहानी तो नहीं भूलेगा ना कैसी बात ही कर रहे हो तुम Yes, glory, glory to God, glory to you, and glory to Jesus. Welcome to the club. Here we go. A little tribute to Mr. Francis Albert. Hit it, baby. Alright. Ah, that's great. This is from my hometown. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. I thought she was going to start spreading them legs. And dropping them eggs. Oh no. I wanna be a part of it. A woodland hills. <laughs> Take a sky day. I don't know the words. You know what I'm gonna say that anyway. Yeah. New York, New York. The hell in New York. We're talking about woodland hills. 
Hills, Woodland Hills, Woodland Hills, very part of it. It's Woodland Hills, Woodland Hills, California. Canoga Park's that too I want to wake up on Ventura Boulevard and die of carbon monoxide poisoning. Come on, Scott. And just lay there until they pick me up. Until they pick you and up. take me away. No insurance or dead meat. I sure little town blues. <laughs> uh, whatever Frank said. Did you like that thing? Now take a good look here at this fucking thing. This is bullshit. I'm telling you, I can do this shit if I put the fucking brush, I shove the brush up my ass, and then I dip it in linseed oil, a little turpentine, and some of that crimson blue paint. I could sit on this canvas. Of course, I'd have to gesso it first, but I'd get that motherfucker cooking with some nice creamy paint. I'd paint this shit in 15 minutes. Don't give me none of this goddamn history of art bullshit about millions of dollars. This motherfucker isn't even finished. Take a look at this bitch. Some fucking six-year-old retarded dwarf living in some goddamn alpine village at the foot of the Tyrolean mountains done fucking painted this. I found it. I found it in the thrift store, goddammit. But still, it has value. It has value. This is one motherfucker. You can almost hear that steam whistle going. You can almost hear it. That's how realistic painting this is. It don't matter if it's shit. And you know, it don't fucking matter if you like it or not. Because what's important about art, even if you don't like it, you buy it. And you hope that the value goes up. It's just a goddamn investment. So don't make no big stink out of the motherfucker. This is bullshit. The whole fucking art world's bullshit. And that's the way it is. Now, if you don't like it, you can kiss my ass. And even more recent, in their groundbreaking show called Deadwood, which I must admit, when I first heard the title of, I thought they were talking about the Pope. <laughs> that's just too much to believe, isn't it? Another groundbreaking show that just does so much for the English language. I am so glad to be coming to you now on HBO where I can speak my mind freely. Oh, yes, glory, glory to God, glory to you, and glory to Jesus. Oh, yes, I am so glad I saved myself for Christ. And now I've saved myself for you. But most important, I've saved the best for HBO. I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen so far, you cocksuckers. From the whole history of the motherfucking cave paintings to the son of a bitch Egyptians, it doesn't get any better. God damn, this is motherfucking good stuff. Oh, yes. I am so glad I saved myself for Christ. And now I've saved myself for you. But most important, I've saved the best for HBO. Now, here's a real primitive type of thing that I like. Because it's got animals in it. Crazy motherfucking animals with claws that just cut your cut your skin up and claw you to death. It's got lions and shit and crazy men with muscles all sweaty and shit. It's got a horse in it. I like horses because they've got big dicks. I'm telling you something here. I'm looking for you, sea biscuit. Got naked bitches with fucking men raping them. I love shit where men's raping women in paints. Got horses with their big stallion penises. Now here's one of my favorite, favorite paintings. It's called The Assassination of Vince Foster. Well, look at the beautiful composition of this goddamn fucking painting. What a motherfucker this is. Just take a look at the way he renders the character's foreground and his foreskin. Well, I tell you, it's enough to make me wet. I'm telling you, this is one fucking...
painting. Take my goddamn word for it. This ain't just no bullshit painting. Look at the way it just just sings to you. What a motherfucker. God damn, this is a fucking great painting. No shit. I'm fucking blown away.